All right. Hey, guys. I am Rhett with the Mix Club. How are you doing tonight? I'm going to be checking out the uh, new plug-in by Sonox, the Claro EQ. Got that thrown up here on a track. Um, this little stock production music track I just created. And uh, any of y'all that haven't stuck around or, well, haven't joined yet, make sure and join. Subscribe to the Mix Club and all that good shit. Anyway, guys, I'm going to get right to it here this evening. <clears throat> Got a lot of stuff going on, so I don't know how long the stream will be, so I'll go ahead and get to it so you can check it out. Um, let's go ahead here, and I'm just going to play you this track. Let me close that so you can see what we're working with. Here you go. Anybody stopping in, let me know how the volumes are on everything, if anything is clipping or distorting, and here we go. This is the track that we'll be working on. Right, guys so basically that is a track that i put together a little stock production music track like i said hey any of you guys out there uh stopping in um 
Also, Logic just dropped their new update, the 10.7.0. Uh, just got that going on in here. Anybody let me know how you're enjoying that. I just got that downloaded, I think, yesterday. I've messed a little bit with the uh, spatial audio on there and uh, using the binaural settings and stuff like that. That's going to be some videos coming up. But anyway, let's get on into this track here and... Let's just start messing with some EQ on this uh, Claro. I've messed with it a little bit, guys, but not a lot at all. Let's just have some fun with it, see what we get going on here. guys checking it out there are a lot of good videos on this explaining all the settings and stuff i'm just going to not do that Kind of gets like the pull trick, pull tech trick going on here. Also got a nice auto game feature if you want to mess with it. So like right now, head on over into the tweak function here. kind of the little more advanced uh, section of it when you head over into like I said the tweak and then you also got the mix that's kind of cool we'll check that out here in a bit you know this is kind of a cool plug-in for you know especially somebody starting out you know right here in the front half keeps it pretty simple with what you're doing and you also got you can get in on uh, your mid side stuff in here as too as well if I can talk tonight been a long day guys Anyway, let's get in here and then you can also right click and you got, you know, you can shut it off. You got your different shelving and stuff you want. Um, you can go left, right, uh, stereo, mid side, get all that going on. You got split where you can actually split your channels and stuff. Anybody stopping in, man, say howdy. Let me know how the audio is sounding. organ here.
like I said, you also have these bars up here right there that you can move along with this here. right over here into the tweak. Yeah, I think that's a pretty cool plug-in. I'm going to be giving her some more testing out and everything. I really like it. There is a lot to it. There are a lot of videos on here, guys. Make sure and check those out that really go through a great explanation. I'm just actually just test driving it, so enjoy. If you're out there don't have anything to do. Oh, also, when I updated Logic to 10.7.0, it kind of lost. I got to go and reprogram all of my uh, uh, X-Touch here. It kind of lost all those settings on there. But, hey, if any of you guys back up to the new Logic, make sure and back up your Logic session. You know, that's pretty easy. Just go there to uh, Applications folder, uh, make a new folder, right-click on it, and uh, save that over there. So that way, if you need to go back, you can. Let's take this to the sides. Check out this guitar here.
That's also one thing cool, like you can do with a fab filter. You can go ahead and select your bands and pull them. I also purchased a new um, SSL. Uh, God, that's horrible, isn't it? Can't remember shit. Uh, X Channel Strip 2. What the hell is it called here? Let's see if it'll pull up and not crash your system. You can't do that with it, though. You can't go like here and here. Unless I'm missing something. Anybody checking in this, you know, knows I'm missing anything, let me know. Yeah, so you cannot grab those and, uh, you know, like you can here on the uh, Claro. Anyway, anybody stopping in here, we are um, checking out the uh, Claro by Sonics. Um, make sure and head over there, pick you up a copy. They got a, I don't remember how long the trial is on it. But anyway, like I said, there are a lot of good videos um, walking you through the plugin, everything you can do. I'm just kind of test driving it, man. I'm just opening it up and just starting digging in and mixing. So you guys, maybe if you get something from that, you know, uh, great. Because I'm learning too with this. Just got it. Now, I wonder if you can click on one of these notes up here and drop a, a point. Oh, hey, that's pretty cool. As you can tell, you know, like I said, people just starting out, this is great. Kind of a little more like mixing on a console, I would guess. Um, but then getting right in, it's just like immediately I want to go over here to start with, you know. Kind of reminds me, like I said, of the Fab Filter stuff a lot. I like that kind of workflow. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, now I know I'm going to mess this part of it up. Anybody stopping in? Uh, drop some comments in here. Let me look here. So how this works. I've seen the videos on it, and be honest with you, I can't remember. It's been a really long day here. And the boy had to get a tooth pulled. Monday we went to the dentist, and they said, hey, we're... When again, what the dentist was going to say, hey, we're going to uh, drill it. And then they came back and said, we're going to drill it and fill it. And I said, well, we talked about pulling it. So, but anyway, they did that. Get home about four o'clock in the morning. The next day he says, hey, <laughs> dad, we, I, I got to go back in. This is worse than it was. So we went yesterday then. So it was Monday we did that. Yesterday we went and had the damn tooth pulled. And uh, that's not double dipping, isn't it? Trying to get business twice. And uh, then today we had to go to the ear doctor. So it's been a long day. So. Anyway, I might miss some few miss a few things here. So, but I know there's a way you can get like some matching. You can see what's going on with your tracks. Try to see where you got buildups and stuff. Let's see if I can figure that out. I got buildups everywhere. Anyway, guys, I am Rhett with the Mix Club. I hope you have enjoyed this little bitty uh, test drive of the Claro by Sonics. Um, if you're not already a member of the Mix Club, go ahead and subscribe and join and do all that good stuff. And that way you'll get notified when I do new videos. Been doing a lot of streaming, trying to get uh, used to that. And uh, let me know if there's anything you'd like to see, and I'll try and get that done for you. But anyway, let's go ahead and let's just see if I can do this here. Okay, let's go ahead and play a little bit of before and after. Here we go.
Anyway, guys, hey, I am Rhett with the Mix Club, man. Thanks for stopping around and checking it out. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and do all that good stuff so you can get notified when I put up new videos. Tomorrow, I'll go ahead and uh, put up a better video with uh, some better A-B comparison. Uh, the final mixes, I'll level match it and stuff for you guys. So if you're interested to hear that at all, uh, be on the lookout for that. Anyway, guys, I am Rhett with the Mix Club. Make sure and also visit themixclub.com. If you need anything mastered, head on over there. Get a free sample master if you're interested. And I'm Rhett with the Mix Club, guys. We'll see you later.